How many mils of a 0 0.20 molar glucose solution are needed to provide a total of 25.0 grams of glucose? You guys think you could do this one on your own, hopefully? So what does it show us? It says the concentration of the solution, right? So the molarity, and I'm just going to put um, C6H12O6. What is that molarity? 0 0.20 molar. Okay, so that's 20 molar glucose. So what does that mean? That means 0 0.20, good job guys, moles of, very good guys, glucose per one liter of solution, right? SOLN solution. Okay, so how many mils are needed to provide a total of 25 grams of glucose? Well, the first thing we're going to have to do is figure out how many grams of glucose we've got in one liter. So um, let's just figure that out. The mass of glucose. Okay, so in one liter, okay, we've got and I'm just gonna keep all these sick pigs for right now. Here, how about this? Before I write that, what's the units of this? Cancel my units. Okay. So just take 25 divided by 36.03, and I get 0 0.693884. But that's liters, right? Not mils. So one liter for every 1,000 mils. Cancel, cancel. So just take that, multiply it by a thousand, and of course you get six hundred and ninety. Well, six ninety-four, but six 
logical how you do it, right? Mm -hmm. So again, you know, how can I do these types of problems without ever seeing them before in my life? It's because I know the process of doing them. Okay? It's all the matter of a process of canceling units, okay? And using those conversion factors that you know. And if you guys can do that, then you should be good. Are there any questions on this one before I kill it? Okay, good job, guys.